The Northridge Jaguars out of Tuscaloosa, Alabama are 6-2 on the season, averaging 30 points a game. A crucial part of their offensive success, junior running back Learic Street. If you watch him run, uh, he only knows one speed, a play, and just a hard-nosed kid, a uh, hard-hitting kid. What makes Street unique? While normal high school football players would be sleeping and relaxing before practice, Street's working a 9-to-5 job. I go to work at 6 in the, in the morning. I wake up about 4. Practice started at like 3-something, 2-something around that time. I go to work. I go to practice with my work clothes on, go through practice, go back home, do a little school work. But what's the necessity for the job? I got to help my mom out like a lot, you know what I'm saying? So I wanted to get cleats and stuff for football. Now there's some days Learic Street would go from weight training to a shift here at the 15th Street Wendy's in Tuscaloosa and then back to school for practice while balancing schoolwork in between. And you would think with all of that wear and tear, you're bound to get an injury at some point on the football field. But for Learic Street, the injury didn't come slamming into linebackers. It came from walking too much on the floor of this Wendy's. I had shin splits, shin splits, and like I work in big boots, the only boots I could afford at the time. Well, we had to school him on what kind of shoes and stuff he's wearing as he's working 40 hours a week and, you know, wearing boots was taking a toll on his legs a little bit. With 600 yards and six touchdowns in six games, it seems Street's legs are healthy. His end goal is to earn a Division One scholarship, but the main takeaway Street hopes recruiters see? My character. I, I think they should look at how I respond to things and how I am as a person. Reporting in Tuscaloosa from the University of Alabama, I'm Dom Taylor.